hello and welcome to the lady circle and as you can see we're looking very beautiful on this episode we're taking you up north and right here on the lady circle we've been championing the ghana month agenda i mean eating ghana wearing ghana seeing ghana and everything that has to do with our beautiful country ghana already it's been four weeks in the month of March and every single Saturday, we've brought you something special on Ghana. Haven't we done well? We've done absolutely amazing absolutely and we deserve amazing. a round of applause. Yeah. And for this special Nothing episode, you can call me the beautiful Rukaya. And I'm about to get married. And so you see how to say, I, I've got some rich allergy to come and marry me. And so call me what? Rukaya. And Helen here, what's your name as well? <laughs> well, hello to you, Adita. Good evening. Uh, this evening, I'm calling myself Zaina. Zaina, you're going to be part of my, you know, bridal train as well. And we have here Miss Akofa. Hi, guys. And you are? I will be known as uh, Chana hey. for, for this episode. Chana. You That's see? a beautiful name. Oh. I believe it is, but I don't know, I don't know if I don't understand it yet. Okay. Mm. Yeah. But you look so like maybe. a Chana. Wow. Oh, Thank you very out. much. You do look like a Zainab. Bro. I believe yeah. so. You believe Thank so. you. So they understand what <laughs> really? means, you know? <laughs> But ladies, you look absolutely beautiful. And Thank you. They were wrapping up north. But mm -hmm. how has the month of March entirely mm. been for you, Helen? Oh, I've been eating Ghana. That's been the best part. Mm -hmm. You know, all the banku and all the other delicacies. But it's always <laughs> exciting to learn more about our rich cultural history from the north all the way down to the south. We're different in many ways. But the one thing that unites us is that we're all Ghanaians. So I have thoroughly enjoyed Ghana Month. Mm, a nice one. What of you, Chana? Well, uh, I've been leaning more towards the music. Mm -hmm. I've been listening to a lot of music, playing a lot of Ghanaian music on radio as well. The food, yeah. You know, I usually eat the food all the time. Mm. So, yeah. It's a little bit of that and more of the music and watching. I actually chanced and I told you so not long ago on mm -hmm. TV3. So, I was like, whoa. I heard about that film and I've never seen it. So, yeah. It's one of those things. Yeah, one of those things. It's mm. been amazing so it's, far. It's been yeah. very amazing. I love the dress, you know, the dress up and playing yes. different yes. Characters yes. today, you're from the north, the next one, you're from the south, the east, and it's been beautiful. I yeah. wish we could do this like all Every throughout the time. year. Yeah, <laughs> I time. agree. It's I exciting. Agree. Yeah. I agree. Very I exciting. But let's say thank you to GTP, and of course, right here on the Lady Circle, when it comes to wearing Ghana, you know, we go all out for our GTP family. So thank you so much, and a big thank you going out to Yaz Sanitary Pad for holding us down as well. And also a very big thank you to Onga Seasoning Powder for Stews and Soups and also Woodine Le Createur. Now, throughout the month of March, I do hope you've been sending some local fuel to the right places. Well, Vodafone Cash can help you do so. So thank you to Vodafone Cash and also to Yamvita. Mm, and then when it comes to enjoying all your favorite, favorite Ghanaian meals, we're still in the Ghana month. We're not done yet. And after, you know, you had your banku and all of that, you want some sweet something, you know, Helen and I, Chana, you know, yeah, 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 mm. so you need some go slow to, you know, just, just, you know, settle the food nicely. And that yeah. is where go slow comes in. It is Ghana's first locally produced premium ice cream brand. And so it has lots of variants all for you to enjoy. Thanks going out to Onga Seasoning Powder for stews and soups and also to Woodine Le Creator. On the show every weekend we bring you some guests to hang out with and today is no exception. Let's check out our guest profile. Of applause. So exciting to see you Yala. You, you, so you had a long journey here but we're happy that you could be here with us. Welcome again. You've been very busy. A little. A little busy. Yes. Doing this and doing that. Yes. What's been happening? Uh, I've been singing, jumping off and on stage, uh, doing car wheel, doing the raw, performing, entertaining people from different parts of the world. Yes. And I'm back here. Yes. It's good to have you. You are indeed the lioness of Africa. So good to see you again. Yeah. So good to see you. Let's take a seat. Let's take a seat. It's going to be an incredible show. We know that for Absolutely. sure. Absolutely. And we're saying a very big thank you to Yaz uh, for supporting uh, the Lady Circle. Now, Yaz is boasting of the fact that they've got new extra long sanitary pad on the Ghanaian market. Now, whatever flow uh, you know you're experiencing as a woman, they've got you sorted. And so you can go on to the Ghanaian market, whatever you know. Uh, circumstance you find yourself in that time of the month they have you uh, fixed right there now the purple experience is simply lit Yaz caring brand for caring families now we're going for a quick break when we come back there's more stay tuned in 
the powerhouse we are in studio with us today it's going to be an amazing day we're talking music fashion afro pop alternative uh, music the evolution and the fusion of the two if you will uh, ghana turned 65 years old this month and whilst we're celebrating ghana month we're also casting our minds back to also see where we have come mm -hmm. from we do have a video to show you all and we can see how um, some Ghanaians and celebrities enjoyed Independence Day and some of the fashion that was on display. It was the video of uh, some Ghanaians celebrating Independence Day in style. We all, I'm coming to you. What do you make of the evolution of Ghanaian fashion where we are today? I think uh, it's amazing. We have grown and we have gone back to pick up some of, if I'm not even some, almost all. Mm. Because for me, I have a feeling it got to a point we all realized that we're getting lost. Mm -hmm. mm. So we say, wait a minute. <laughs> we are learning other cultures and things, but have we really learned our own properly? Mm. Before you pick up something new, make sure you've learned your own very well that even when you are going, you feel like, okay, now I've had enough. Let me just relax and go back into your own uh, fashion. Then all the videos that you've seen, the patriotism is growing and it's amazing. And I think it's getting better and better. And we are very confident and comfortable with our tradition and the fashion. And you can see it is oozing. Everybody is just like, you know what? This is me. This is, this is a Ghanaian man or a Ghanaian woman. This is who I am, unapologetic. And they are rocking it. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. Yes. It's so beautiful. Juanita, well, what do you make of it? Where we've come uh, to now? Yala says, in fact, we've taken some steps back to reclaim what they call Sankofa. <laughs> I mean, it's, it's exciting because we've moved from it being just um, a celebration on 6th March where you see people rocking their um, Guinean outfits and being all patriotic and going all out for our culture. It's moved from that just one day to now a whole month. And even throughout the whole year, you see people rocking on any day. The African prince, the traditional attires, either to church, to functions, to what have you. So it's very, very beautiful. And I think we, we need to applaud ourselves for how we've been able to embrace how beautiful our culture is. And we're doing more. Look, look, just look at us. I mean, this is beautiful. And people are modernizing it in a bit, but we've still not lost touch with how, you know, culturally oriented we've always been as a people just look at Bella Nanekia Dubeka their costumes to our very own her excellency uh, Samira Baumia it was it was just beautiful I love yeah. it I love it it's exciting yeah. Akofa could we be doing more yeah I believe so because I'm going to pick this from uh, there was there was a time on one of those uh, blog sites uh, these uh, you know online buying platforms and you you will see um, you know that thing that they used to do the the flour that's that sack. yeah you see a model in it and the price is to the top and you're that like is true this is a, a thing we put flour in to make bread so if these people are acknowledging the fact that this is how important these fabrics are why aren't we doing the same so like, at the end of the day people are also asking for the fact that just as Anita mentioned let's move away from just celebrating it for a month and only on Fridays it has to be an everyday thing so even if you're not going to wear African prints every day like there should be a touch of it in your outfit one way or the other hopefully we get to tell the world that you know what we haven't forgotten that we have this amazing style and we'll let you see you will feel it wherever we are that's that's about it yeah and that's an important point you made because the Western world will take our mm -hmm. design Designs, yeah. our concept. In fact, these days, even Ghana must go as haute couture. It yes. It's on every <laughs> runway. Go to NYC, Milan, Paris. That's what they're rocking. And yeah. we are now saying, hey, we have to go and reclaim what is ours because That's we can true. also project it onto the outside world. We are like, you are great at sending us out there, mm -hmm. representing us. Mm -hmm. Are you seeing the Ghana must go on the runway? What they are doing to our, our, mm -hmm. our local designs? It's, you see the bags, shoes, <laughs> trousers, hair, mm -hmm. designs jackets and I'm like what and you see the price tag mm -hmm. hey, hey, crazy. Mm -hmm. yeah. it's very 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 sweet price <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it makes me feel very proud but could yes. we be doing some more oh more 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 far more because uh, we are the originators of a lot of our costumes and a lot of our fabric we know how to actually bend it and all the ideas are in our heads mm. and it doesn't matter even if somebody takes it 
but it's in your head yeah. and you can just create. So all we just have to do is just keep creating with confidence. Mm. Put it out there with confidence and you'll be fine. Absolutely. Yes. Now, yeah, I'm going to start charging people abroad for this, your hairstyle. Just watch this. <laughs> All right. I have a special <laughs> price for this. <laughs> okay, well, you're still watching the Ladies Circle right here on TV3. We're having amazing conversations about our independence, how we're celebrating and showcasing our style over the period. Now, I also like to say a very big thank you to Malta Guinness. Now, if you've been enjoying Malta Guinness all this while and you're not aware of some of the benefits that it comes with, let me share a few of them with you quickly. Now, Malta Guinness is high in vitamins B. It gives you the natural energy you need. Also comes with goodness and vitality here and there so while you're going about your normal duties don't forget to pick up a chilled malta guinness just so you can enjoy and uh, yeah anita we've mm -hmm. got some more conversations coming up definitely right? and we're delving into music and fashion mm. now you know music and fashion it goes hand in hand i mean if you're a good musician and your appearance is still not portraying who you are what you're trying to communicate sometimes it is course 90 sometimes and so we are here you make your own costumes yes what of your head? You do it yourself. I have learned to do it myself, uh, especially uh, during emergencies. For example, <laughs> maybe you're going somewhere, you can't take everybody with you. So, uh, but I've learned how to just do it myself. But today I got help from my sister. Wow, that's impressive. My yeah, yeah, wow. My, but my PA rather. Yeah. Oh, so how do you put the costumes together? I mean, does the event you're attending or what you, know, you want to portray also influence the costumes? Of course, almost every time. When I'm going to perform, I first of all, I will check out the crowd and I'll ask the, uh, the organizers, what is the crowd going to be like? Or how, uh, what songs do you want? Mm -hmm. The moment you say rock my body, I know which songs, uh, like which costume to wear. When you say, oh, it's corporate. Ah, then I know which costume so to wear. So the corporate ones, you make it yourself as well? Or uh, yes, uh, almost all. But these days I work with uh, Ghanaian fashion designers as, uh, okay. as well. So what I do is I just get the cloth, traditional cloth, and I just, I cut it up <laughs> and use myself as the mannequin <laughs> because I, I, I know my body is not yeah. uh, like everybody else's. So I have to measure and cut and just cut and then use uh, the thread for sewing or making hair and just stitch it up there. And so that it goes with the... Wow. And yeah. So I make it myself. Because I, I know even trying to stitch an outfit or making those alterations, it's not... It's not Easy like I that. Can't even <laughs> fix a exactly. Exactly. <laughs> you know, she, she can't fix a button, but you're able to do all of that. I mean, with the curries and all the things you yeah. put on it, you do all of those things. I do it myself. But uh, how do you think that has also helped your brand? Do you think you doing it um, yourself has, you know, put you out there, especially when you are on an international platform and you're performing and the whites are like, oh wow. Yes. Um, I think first of all, once I'm going out there, um, my my costumes are actually inspired. Uh, by the traditional outfit. Mm -hmm. When you look at the whole Ghana, every culture, they have a traditional outfit. And there's something we have in common. They are all like beautifully wild mm -hmm. because I'm going to dance. So you don't need something that is going to restrict you. You want to be free. When yeah. you are dancing, you should be free. happy. Yeah. You throw your legs. And most of our dance moves from the Adwa mm -hmm. to the North, sometimes you jump. Mm -hmm. And I've learned a lot of these dances. Like, I've learned a lot. So when I'm going on the stage, I need something that will give me uh, space so that I can split and jump around. <laughs> so I just watch and I cut it myself. And what makes the costume unique is that I make it myself and I can't repeat. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so every costume I make. You wear it is, once? Uh, uh, Sometimes it depends on the costume. If it's one that is really outstanding, I keep it mm -hmm. and keep repeating it because it starts give, uh, giving me a look. And once I'm out there, they're not even thinking Ghana first. They say Africa. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And what makes Africa? Okay, so these are the <laughs> costumes. There are a lot of colors that will work on my complexion. And the fact that I'm from Africa, mm -hmm. that wouldn't work on any other person much. Mm -hmm. The hairstyles, the texture of my hair can do these hairstyles. Mm -hmm. It's not everybody that can do that. So all that went into planning. And I'm like, hmm. So the moment I go, I'm like, <laughs> you never have to say it. Like, oh, they know the line. Who is that? Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Because a lot of musicians take their inspiration from mm. the West. Mm. And that makes them maybe not stand out so much. Mm. So for you, is it also a branding decision, a marketing decision that once you say we are, mm. you know what to expect. Mm. You are unique. There's nobody like you. Uh, first of all, I'm going to ask, is that a branding decision? And also, do you have pressure to look more westernized? I have never gotten any pressure mm -hmm. to look more wet, uh, westernized. I think when I was starting, 
when I did make me that, it was just one time. Some people saw me and thought, wow, you know, you remind us of Grace Jones. And they were trying to work with me. And I realized immediately mm -hmm. I was about to be taken out. Mm. Oh. And I would have gotten maybe popular in Europe before. Mm -hmm. But even got to a point where I said, okay, can you pronounce the word like this? I'm like, oh. And my manager said, no, 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 no. This is not where we are going. Mm -hmm. And I even remember one time Atongo Zimba came and said, don't change her addiction, just leave her alone. I think that was just the only time. Apart from that, I think they got the message, nobody has ever put me under any pressure whatsoever to change or, or be westernized. I think the influence I got is just like a lot of people mm -hmm. growing up. But something in me, I just, I would say, look, I'm ready to learn. Yeah. I'll learn from the west, I'll learn from the north, east, wherever. But one thing I know, I'm very good at is being myself. And that makes me strong and unique and I stand out. And this is how I want to go out there and present myself. And I'm going to do it. And that one, I don't think anybody can change. I'm very, very stubborn about that. <laughs> and, yeah, because that she makes me that. unique. Yeah. Like that. Because I'm a typical, typical Cesala girl. I'm not even ashamed to be a Cesala girl. I'm a Ghanaian. I will speak as a Ghanaian. I laugh like a, a, a Cesala girl would do. I will frown and sometimes, like, when you tell me, I'm like, eh, 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 the people, because this is who I am. Mm. And once you, once I'm out there and I'm talking and all these guests just, they come naturally. It tells people, okay, so if she's like that, does that mean that a lot of the young ladies from her community are like that? So indirectly, you are telling your story, mm -hmm. your behavior, your accent is telling somebody, oh, so this community, when I go, I should be expecting to meet Something a lot like of the this. young women, kind of like her, and yeah. So mm. that one, I don't joke with it. And when I finally come to realize that it's a good branding, me, and myself, and my management, it wasn't deliberate. Mm -hmm. we, I just did it for the fun. Mm, yeah. And part of my mind was, well, everybody is this way. Can I just do something different? Mm -hmm. But that doesn't mean I am not educated. Mm. I can't speak English like some people used to say, oh, if you dress too traditionally, you look, you look like you, you can't speak English or even express yourself. <laughs> and I mean, yourself. what's wrong with that? And I'm like, <laughs> we don't uh, have to speak English. We don't yeah. have to, I'm like, yeah. if I, there should also be learning since and other things. Exactly. And, yeah, and I said, well, anyway, I have the upper hand after I've learned English and I've learned other languages. So I'm not, I don't have a problem. And at the end of the day, it's just me being me. So mm, yeah. I didn't mind. I just kept going, kept going until people realized, you know what? That's where I just yeah. accept. And we and love you for amazing. that. Yeah. We love now you for that. Now your costumes, you say they are one of a piece. And hopefully one day we'll go to a museum and we can see them there. Mm -hmm. But yeah. what if some of us also want to replicate the wildness, that, that lioness style? Yes. Will you be going into fashion designing or mass production soon? No. Oh. Um, no, unfortunately. I'm, I'm, some <laughs> of us want to split and raw. And, you know. If you want me to <laughs> make a dress for you, I'll, I'll, I'll call you or you come to me and I'll measure your waist, your buttocks, your legs, <laughs> your, your chest. Because every dress I make yeah. is for just a particular body. Mm -hmm. okay. And I, I, I'll be able to repeat something close to what I'm wearing, of course, uh, to look the same. But I have to uh, sew it around you oh. so that it's just for you. So every costume I have is like uniquely made. You can't repeat it. Mm -hmm. And as I'm doing it, people kept encouraging me to do uh, to go into fashion, but that's like a whole <laughs> new look. Maybe if somebody's watching, they want to take up that aspect. Lioness I don't. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I think we should start talking. Listen, <laughs> let's do it. You can take it over and then I'll just say, you know what, my yeah. sister helped me because it gets to a point, you can't do everything mm -hmm. on your own. Yeah. You need help. You need to share. You need support. So I'm all in for someone coming and saying, can I just lioness cut all? I say, no problem. Here's my logo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I, I, I'll just keep singing, but make sure you give me some of the addresses. Mm -hmm. and I, yeah. them. I don't have a problem. But mm. personally, I'm like, oh, that's a lot of work. That's why I said no initially. Mm. Yeah. yeah. But I'm ready wow. to show. Wow. Wow. I, I, I absolutely love how original you've been. I'm glad you are, you know, all over. I mean, international platforms, and you were in Dubai with Steve Bedi doing your thing. I saw the pictures and I was like, wow, I follow you on Facebook. And so I see most of the things you post. I'm like, we need to celebrate people like we are, Lamo, and that's why we brought you in. So thank you. We, we love you. And I pick so much from you. Being authentic, being your genuine mm. self, loving yourself just the way you are, mm. and not trying to 
you know, change things. I am very lean towards GTP. I remember um, when I started wearing a lot of it, people go like, hey, who did they be out African print? Mm. They be out pictures. <laughs> there were times, every time when I, I make the post, it's like mm. I'm always in African print. And I'm like, you do not know what I am trying to achieve. You do not know how happy that makes me. Mm. And um, it, is, it is working for me. I love yes. it when I'm rocking my African yes. print and I won't mind doing it every day. And so we love you, Rihanna. Thank we you. really, really Thank do. You. We do, we do. And I actually also wanted to find out from you, with all the fame that has come with your, your mm -hmm. career so far, how do you stay grounded throughout all of this? Uh, my community, I your think. Your community. helps me a lot. And uh, my family around me. I, I have not changed much, really. I'm, I'm still Riala, and I grew up in Funsi. And whenever I go back home, and I come out, and I see the environment, it kind of just grounds me, like, it tells, it tells me, you are very lucky to be where you are. Look at the environment <laughs> and know where you are coming from. It hasn't been easy, so don't mess up. Mm. Yeah. That's just how I feel. Right. And the children, when they come around, they remind me how I, I, I was also a kid. And I wish somebody came to my community. Yes, I come yeah. and say, hey, come and dance. And unfortunately, it didn't happen. So now that I found myself in a position to do something about it, mm -hmm. I'm doing it without asking anybody's permission. I'm just doing it because right. it's good, it's positive and is to inspire. Whether I like it or not, I've become a role model or a mentor to some of the young people mm. there. And there's, and there's nothing I can do about it. I'll be running and be like, no, come back here. <laughs> <laughs> so you are going to be role model because you are the only one that is mm -hmm. doing mm -hmm. this. So the community keeps me grounded mm. and um, my family as well. For them, That's especially amazing. my mother, she yeah. doesn't care whether I'm a superstar. <laughs> <laughs> so my friend gets up and go and eat. I don't like the way you are losing weight. My friend go and eat. And then oh, she would just get angry if I do something that is not right. She will scold me. Mm -hmm. mm. Anybody who comes to her, she will scold all of us, including my dad. They'll be like, oh, your mother. That's the mama lion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Fuyala, I am very inspired by you. I like to think of myself as being a bit different, a bit quirky, not quite the norm. And when I watch you, I feel like I can be my authentic self. I see you on your motorbike in, the, in your area, in your local area. You're just going up and down, just living your normal life. So from Sisala to everywhere else, those of us from Isium in the yes. eastern region, yes. we love it as well. Like, I know you are big on authenticity as yes, well. Yes, yes, yes. I actually love her music. Uh, on International Women's Day, I was playing, uh, you know, a lot of her songs. And I'm like, listen, this woman, has, she just has it. And, you know, just as you mentioned earlier, her community grounds her. She picks inspiration from her community and all of that. And so watching someone like that, you wouldn't mind being inspired by somebody like this, okay? Because at the end of the day, people think that you need to look a certain way to, you know, be up there or be out there. She's shown that, listen, no matter where you're coming from, you can make it and I really love that about her trust me I really really do love that about her yeah that's amazing yeah. that's truly truly inspiring it doesn't matter where you're coming from you can be your genuine self. Now, we've got a message for you from Cousins Baby New Wipes. Now, babies deserve the very best of care, especially when it comes to cleaning them up, which is why Cousins Baby Wipes is the best for every mum. It's new, it's improved. You get 80 wipes in each pack. It's thicker as well. It's what every new mum needs in her bag, in her stash, in the nursery as well. Now, Cousins Baby Wipes are available in mother care shops, malls, and super supermarkets nationwide. Cousins Baby, growing together naturally. We're going to take a very quick break. When we come back, there's more discussion, more music, more excitement, more games, and everything in between. This is still The Lady Circle. A lot of you loving Wiala on the show this evening. Keep using the hashtag the Lady Circle. We have the powerhouse, as I mentioned, the lioness of Africa yes. here with us. We're having such an amazing time. It's been such a fruitful and a rich discussion so far. But let's have some fun now, mm -hmm. shall we? Wiala, what is the song uh, that you're enjoying the most at the moment? At the moment, it's Coming With Fire, which I just released. This is Ooh. your own song, yes. Coming With Fire. Yes. Let's get into it. Yes. And you'll do a little performance for us. Yes. All right. Okay. Okay. It goes like this. These drums on the beat, can you hear it? Boom, boom, doom, doom, can you feel it? My city, my town, can you breathe it? Our sound, our mind, can you dream it? Make it go boom, boom, like a conga. Take a bow, forget the haters. All this for the love, not for paper. Two eyes on the price, I'm a trooper. Don't you play, boy, don't you play with fire. Fire go burn you. The fire go burn you. Don't you play, boy, don't you play with fire. Fire go burn you. 
don't go for smile, make a feel you. Hey. My champion will make a cheer you. I do you do, make a marry you. If you know feel move, make a carry you. Joe boy, Joe boy, do the carry go. Hey. If you want woman show, make you tell them. You for one your body like a yo yo. We go jam all night to the people. Hoo. Don't stop the fire. Hoo. Bada dam bada. Hey. Higher and higher. Hoo. Never, never stop me now. Don't stop the fire. Bada dam bada. Higher and higher. Never, never stop me now. Don't you play, boy? Don't you play with fire? The fire go burn you. The fire go burn you. Wow, 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 You know, wow. Helen, you know, we, 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 can, we can also do this, you know. I mean, you know, we have our musical exactly. duo. Exactly. So, sing, yeah, you know? yeah. We actually gave her the guitar <laughs> and everything. We thought, yeah. hey, you know, yeah. yeah. So, shouts to us. No, Maybe we can do a small no, remix. Yeah, I think it's of the bar. Can we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're going to do a small remix. Okay. We'll do the lyrics. Yeah. 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 Same beats. Yeah, right. I think the lyrics are going to be Okay. So, welcome to the Lady Circle. Woo! It's the best show on Saturdays. Woo! If you're not tuned in, Ooh. where else do you want to be? Ooh. We're here every hey. Saturday. Ooh. The time is 6 p.m. Next week, we'll be back as well. Ooh. You want to be here every Saturday. Ooh. 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 Don't you play, Ooh. 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 Hey, boy, don't you play with fire. <laughs> fire the venue. Fire the venue. Come on tour with you. Of yeah. course, you okay. can come on tour with Thank you. Me. We yes. would love I, that. Yes, yes. Amazing. <laughs> Let's Amazing. sing. It's actually charged in here right now. But we also like to say a very thank you going out to you. Go slow. Now, whatever moment you're having with your friends, your family, there's one thing you can add on to to make it extra special, extra nice. Now, they're telling you they've got amazing flavors for you. There's chocolate and almond flavor. There is cookies and cream. There's peanuts and salted caramel. No matter your mood or self-care, Go Slow has got you sorted. Now, get yourself a tab of Go slow from any supermarket near you and also a shell fuel station shop near you now if you're looking for both refreshment and inspiration malta guinness says you can find both with them you get the best of both worlds so it's a natural refreshment to keep you on top of your game it's brewed from locally sourced raw materials for that unique refreshing taste that you and i absolutely love so if it's malta guinness and pizza that you enjoy malta guinness and plantain chips malta guinness and banku whatever it is that you enjoy listen inspiration and refreshment all in one place so come to the malta guinness side of life come and enjoy a world of good malta guinness is absolutely refreshing and delicious well, there's no lady circle without some game. So guess what? We're playing a game as usual now because we're celebrating fashion independence going all the way back and all of that. Ladies will let me know what is inspiring them on this paper now. So I'm going to share. So we pick uh, a paper each. We start with Wiala. Um, Helen, here you go. Thank you. Okay. And here you go as well. So in 60 seconds, we're all going to draw something can that we believe someone can put on. I don't know if for a fashion week. Either way, <laughs> let's see how it goes. All right, so in 60 seconds, will we be timed down, guys? Yeah. Oh, we're good to go. Are we timing ourselves? Okay, so nobody should spy. Let's go. <laughs> let's go. Okay. This is reminding me of back in kindergarten. Why do I know this is so okay. cool? <laughs> so, okay, stop. I think our time is up. Our time is up, uh, ladies. Oh. Our time is up. Okay. Uh, let, me, let me just add the shoes. Hey. <laughs> well, then means let me add my hat. Uh, let me add the leg. <laughs> okay, our time is up. Time is up. Um, time okay, so is up. we're showing it to the camera in three, two, one. Okay, so <laughs> mine. I took it back to like the. 60s and 70s, you know when they used to do their pop pop. Hey. Okay. So that's pop pop here. Okay. There's bantu knots, you know that. Yeah, yeah. 
Yes, yeah, so I did a bit of that. I know Oshemuk. Oshemuk. <laughs> this is this is the mook. And this, is, this is cover and slit. <laughs> so this effort. is the puff forehand and this is the slit. Uh, that's, so that's a good this is Anita illustration. <laughs> and um, I come to you, Helen, right? Helen? Yes. Let's um, see. Okay, so this is my design. Wow. Taking it back, it has a high slit. I put Aww. a little heart where the slit is. And then you have a thunderbolt as well on the top. These um, sleeves, they make, they're making a comeback. Yes. So it's a nice little sleek dress that you can take somewhere elegant but fun. Go! Right, so since I'm in charge of the game, we will allowed to see yours. Yes. <laughs> this is mine. Oh, oh wow! Ooh. Oh, yeah, yeah. I keep small because I did visual. So. Oh, <laughs> <don't mind>. Wow! <laughs> yeah, so this is uh, one. Uh, this one you can actually wear for any dance mm. you are going to do on the stage, traditional dancing. Mm -hmm. And it's actually one of the costumes. This is what I do before I mm. sew. Oh, so it's just a top to hold the, uh, okay. the top and then okay. uh, 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 shredded uh, down. Mm -hmm. uh, so you can for dance your split. at all. Yeah, for the mm -hmm. split. So so you can wear this for But this one, you dance. wear shorts underneath. Yeah, you wear Otherwise, shorts they'll see your glory. Uh -huh. <laughs> so you package well before you package wear Package well. <laughs> All right, nice Just one. Just for dancing. Can I get a drum roll, please? Hey. I'm not hearing the drum roll. I'm not showing this. <laughs> 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 Hello. Okay. Well, it's wow. supposed to be a skirt. You know, uh, if you can see my bow, uh, that's sort of skirt. But I didn't get the inspiration right, guys. Let's so see this again. No, Papa. we're not. We're not. <laughs> no, I think at home they want to see it. Let's see it, Papa. Oh, I am holding it. Like, this is it. Keep it still. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> it's just if you can see my bow, people. So we're still celebrating Ghana. It's still the month of March and the celebrations are not over yet. And we've been talking about eating Ghana. Now, for the snacks part of eating Ghana, I mean, I like my polo, you know, near action, chin, chin. Now, we will be out to grill, grill, grill. Yeah, that's the one I like. Oh, I also love my adunle. Or if you also want to go abroad for some kakra, you can do it with your pizza, the cheesy pizza, your donuts, your samosas, your spring rolls, and granuts. Now, Morty Guinness goes with everything that you want to enjoy you can try Morta guinness with your favorite snacks today and you can check Morta guinness on social media to tell them about your best Morta guinness and snacks combo especially with your local snacks Morta guinness bringing you a world of good well how about you also add some nutri snacks to that combo the nutri snacks biscuits are made from oats and whole wheat they're high in fiber Totally devoid of trans fats. If you want to look as fit and as sexy as we are like here, you're going to want to avoid trans fats. And Nutri Snacks can help you do just that. It's a perfect way to keep unhealthy snacks at bay. We're going to go for a quick break, mm -hmm. and we are is going to do that for us in Sisala. Okay. Hmm. Mm. We're still having so much fun right here on the Lady Circle. We're so glad that you could keep us company this evening. Some thank yous though going out to our sponsors, to Yaz. GTP, Woodin, Vodafone Cash, Onga, Yamvita, Cousins Baby Wipes, Nutri Snacks, and Malta Guinness. We're getting to that part of the show that you and I love so much. It is time for Guilty Not Guilty! guilty. Okay, let me see if my cards are right. All right, so okay, ladies, so uh, are we ready? So we all also take yes. parts. Yes, so when I ask the question, if you're guilty, you show your guilty card. If you're not guilty, you show, so you understand what's happening. All right, so we're good? We We're good? good. Yeah. I'm, I'm the quiz master, even though I'm parts. Anyways, let's go. Have you ever snooped through someone's stuff? Could be a boyfriend. I found exactly what I was looking for. Yeah. You did? Mm. Yeah. Again, we always do. No, I actually was snooping through. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Moving on. Um, have you ever deleted something on social media because it did not get many likes? No, ma. Uh, yeah. No, ma. Yeah. Why didn't you like it? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, no, you can't see. There's a conversation about you not liking your own posts. People believe it means you don't. 
I like my own post. I mean, it's my post. Oh if I no! Don't like it, who Listen, no, there are two schools of thought. Yeah, I believe what Anita is saying. If you don't like what you've posted, who else do you think would want to like it? And then there's the other side that says you're too mobile that you have to like your own <laughs> post. Wow. So I don't know. But anyways, <laughs> we're moving on. This one also says, "Have you ever pretended to be sick to get out of something?" Have I? Hey, proudly. <laughs> it's like today, everything is okay. And the last one says, "Have you ever believed a place was haunted?" Yeah. Oh yes. yes. My house. Oh, yes. Very, 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 very. Yes. After I watched was, a horror movie, there was an area. <laughs> there was an area in there. So that's the ladies for guilty, not guilty. Thank you. And we hope at home you're also making your guilty, not guilty plaque so that you can play along with us, you know, in front of a television screen as well. But. How exciting has it been today, very, ladies? Very, Super it's exciting, been Riella. It's been We're so amazing. glad that you could join us. It's Thank been such an amazing Thank time. You. What's Thank up next for you? I know you're a jet setter. Where are we going to be seeing you next? Um, where are we going? Oh, yeah. That's a good where question. Are where are we going? Yeah. All of yeah. us. We need to blacklist these two. <laughs> 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 we are going. We are, in fact, we are going forward with a positive vibe, good mm -hmm. energy, and I have a few more shows to perform in Ghana before I leave. Ghana for my usual European tour. Mm. Lovely. Yes. I'm already booked. In fact, I was booked since last year. So we are booked, oh, and, wow. busy. booked and busy. <laughs> <laughs> booked yeah. and busy. Yeah, people have to work out. Amazing. Lovely. We do hope that next time, you know, you'll be able to pass through and grace us with that an amazing performance and amazing of conversation course. as well. Of course. Thank mm. you so much for having me. Thank, Thank you for you. coming. Thank you. And so we have a let's let's do some magic with the uh, yes. guitar. Um, I wish I could try, but you know, I'll just leave you as I've taught you. <laughs> so, yes, oh, yeah. You have been a very yeah. good teacher. <laughs> <laughs> so that's it for the ladies' circle this evening. Thank you so much for joining us. And taking us home is our lioness. We're about to roll. Yes. Let's go. Let's go. We are going heaven goes where we are going, we know who it is, we'll get there, we will get there, heaven knows how we will get there, we know who we will, it will be hard. Yeah.